Hey guys, welcome back. Ninja Lime here once again for some more Infinity Wars. This is going to be a slightly different episode. Normal, we have these bottom two decks here. I've been uh, messing with some interesting... Um, that is not the one we're looking at right now. Oh, well, I was going to show you the cards, but take a peek at them before. We're going to play just a couple of standard games, so that way we can... Um, do I like these cards? Yeah. But we can... Well, I don't know. I don't have a lot of people, but... Oh, well. Um, see if we can't come up with a new... Kind of, you know, deck layout or something. Hopefully we can... I don't think he's going to be able to play anybody, so I'll just leave him there. A new kind of... Security set up. I have this one that's two flame dawn and a warpath, and then I have that other one that, uh, like an overseer, a demon, and a factionless or something. That's pretty, pretty interesting. I thought okay, this may be good, but get this out there. Have it. I don't know that he's going to have a lot of um, vigilance cards or any. His main problem is this, or his main threat for us is this card right here. So he's just going to try and stack his graveyard with everything, and then on turn 7, he's just going to get a huge number of these conscripted militia. Actually, now that he has a person, we're going to pull him back. We are going to play this. No, let's play this, because we want to put him on the defending side. And then after that, we will... Um, okay. Here you go. I'll start doing Okay, I'm gonna do that. we're going to put you here. We're going to put you down because you're not going to be hit. We can do this. I wonder if he's going to come out. He may. Did not. Okay. We're going to do this again. He gains. Oh, destroy target character. You may want to hold on to this. He may just be trying to... Hold off until he can play that. Probably a good idea for him, anyways. Um, do this, and let's put you back because I'm. I bet you're about to come play, and you are. Oh, I should have played on him. Oh well. Oh well. Well, you survive that. And now you died. Oh, because of Flame Strike 2. Oh, that's sweet. Um, how do we want to do this? Do we want to leave you here? Well, no, because he may put that guy. We're going to pull him back. We are going to play. Oh, actually. Oh, he didn't deal damage to our fortress. We are going to probably play you, because I bet we're going to need somebody with Unstoppable. And let's Um, actually, let's just go ahead and use it. Okay, yeah, that's what I was afraid of. Ouch. This may help us, although he's not gonna... He can't, oh, he can't be moved from there. Um, we're gonna put him down here. And return one of you guys up there. It'll reduce your overall thing. You give everybody a boost? No, okay. This is when he's on the battlefield, so he won't help us right now. We probably need to put another 10-10 guy here. And you have haste, okay? Well, I'll just make sure you're in the front of your zone. That way you can kill him. And... You can go and you. Okie dokie. Let's see how that goes. Surely it's not that one big. It's not. This may have been a poor deck for us to fight against.
but we can do this. Play Carter Golem. We're gonna have to play you here. We get some people out. I really don't want to put him on defense. Man, this flame strike is uh really coming in handy. Hmm. I think he he could still get us. Oh yeah. Here we go. Oh yeah, we're in trouble. Oh, oh, we had a um, martyr going, didn't we? Okay, we got us a drop bear. We're definitely going to have to use that. How does he have zero health? I don't even understand how that's possible. Okie dokie. Um, oh, so I could do this. Let's just take care of the third one there. And all that. Did I enrage him? I think I did. I really hope so. But you can kind of get a ha an idea of how this deck works. And we may play a second match with them just to see. And the next time we'll go into that that other deck that I had selected when we very first started. Hopefully that will work out. Ooh. Okay. Uh oh. Well played. GG. I just did not quite have the the firepower to do that, but we'll return to menu. Go up again. This is not an especially quick deck. What was that deck? Was this? Oh yeah, Warpath one flamed on too. Fast again. Hope. Okay, play the cards, but not going to happen. Do I like this? Yeah. Ooh. You know all about um, our deck set up like that. I know we got to watch out for death rays and stuff, so this guy may not be um, around with us for too long, which is going to be annoying. No, so he's got guy up here. Interesting. Let's check this out. Doing an awful lot of thinking on turn one. Oh, there we go. Don't use AA. We will play this. Hmm. Anchor. What is our strategy? Okay. Um, I would like to get this guy out. This is just kind of annoying. Don't can't really do anything. Oh, Callie's really good. We should probably get Callie out. Hopefully, I really wish we could get that uh, brimstone thing. We've got a timely strike. We should probably um, try and use that at some point. I really like this card, especially when we get an exhaust or something. Oh, should have pulled him back. What I get. Now, what do we want to do? Let's play this just to annoy him. Then next turn, we'll start putting out more people that can um, do some work for us. Real shame. But we have enough, um, hopefully enough cards from the Warpath here just to mount a sizable offense if we need to. Acolyte of the Crypt. Ooh, he's really good. We have five. 
I think we should probably do this. And we'll work on this. Then we can play Hakeem. Everybody will have Unstoppable. But I was thinking that maybe sometime in the near future, I'll announce a little bit ahead of time, maybe we could do, or I'll stream, we can do some viewer games if anybody's in. But, okay. I see. Fair enough. So we want to play this. Now we're going to play this. You can start defending. Hopefully, if he has another death ray, he'll use that and try to hit a Brahmic here who I pulled back. Gotcha. Still pumping that guy up. We're going to play another one of these guys. Really just start putting a herd on him. We're not going to play Bromic yet. I'm afraid that he's thinking I'm going to. You'll still survive this turn. You should. I mean, I would go after Bromic if I had a death ray because he has this, you know, plus two attack to everybody else in there. But maybe he wouldn't. Guess we'll find out right now. Okay. Okay, oh, this is good for us. So let's throw this down. Let's could do this. We'll go ahead and do that. And we will play play you. I want to play you. In 12, or this guy will pay 3. He'll be, you know, a 13. 14. Guy also has the, the attack. No, we're gonna play this guy. I see we're gonna swap up the order here. This one's going down. We're gonna have to keep an eye out for this guy because he's gonna make. Actually, I wonder if we should save this card for when he attacks. Let's do that. We'll save that card. We'll play this. And enrage him next turn. And we are going to play. Eventually, he's going to play this guy. Ha! Ah. And. Bet he's going to expect a play now. We're going to throw a drop bear down. 25. Want to activate you. Want to play this. Hopefully he'll go after this. No, we're going to go all out here because, oh no, if we do, then we can't play this. That'll give everybody unstoppable. Probably what we want. Right? Um, actually, we should probably play this, too. Play this while we have a bunch of people. Next turn, we'll play this guy. I imagine we'll take a death right here. Ooh. You gain unstoppable? No. We ended up uh, securing that victory there. G. And return to menu. We're going to take a quick overview at the cards. Then we'll call it there. And give a sneak peek at next time. Let's see. What are we? We need to come up with a good name for this too. But let's go ahead and select this. Uh, why are you bad? I don't know. 
it's just a bug, I guess. First off, in our command zone, we got Hakeem, we have Chlor, and we have Bromic. These actually work. You know we just saw played with them. Please also make sure you leave uh, comments below on how you think this goes. Um, let's see. We have Martyr Golem, Drop Bears, Life 5 Passing. I'm not going to read them all. Just kind of scroll through here so you can see what we have. Terror Moose. I like this because it can't take non-combat damage. But we do have 56 cards, and I would like to cull some of them. He, he may be a good choice. He may also be a good choice. I chose him because he has two lives, and that can come in handy. I like this guy. I haven't actually got to um, utilize him yet, but I have two of them now. So I want to try them. Tithe Collectors, annoying to the enemy. I don't know if they're actually worth um, two of our spots or not. Let me know. Got Sacculus. Um, Flame Dawn Hounds, Proctal the Sniper. Almost put this in my um, command zone, but I didn't um, didn't know who to get rid of. And I wanted him to be here for sure. And then I thought, well, I kind of like Bromic there. And our abilities, I may get rid of Fight. I don't know. Vitality, Fight, Stumble, Swift Strikes, Exhaust, several Timely Strikes, Monster Hunter, Retaliation. Fortress Flame Dawn, two of these Brimstones, and a Brom Expander. And that is you know, how we're going. The, the overall idea behind this deck is really just, you know, there's not a lot of control or anything. It's just, you know, oh, a brute force kind of deck. But we do have a little bit of control with these Timely Strikes and DOS, but it's real, real limited. But... Let me know what you think, and next time we will check out this deck, which is um, interesting in itself, but I will see you guys next time. Please remember to like, favorite, subscribe.